Left the babies on three. One, two, three. It's extremely important for me to have an impact away from the game. And giving back via my foundation allows me to create an outlet for kids who are gifted with being able to play the game of football. Seven on seven football is football of the future, I feel like. It's the AAU of football. It usually happens in the springtime. So it kind of makes football not just a seasonal sport, it makes it a year-round sport. You know, my tournaments pretty much range a variety of different cities and places, but they all have a, a personal connection to me. We have tournaments in Atlanta, Georgia, a birthplace to myself, Charlotte, North Carolina, Alabama, and we do take the kids to Florida as well. It's an unbelievable way to make kids hone in their fundamentals of the game of football. You know, in the area I grew up in, football is king. One of the biggest support systems for me was my father. My father played football, I wanted to be just like him. He planted a seed in my mind that if you're gonna do something, you know, you do it to the best of your ability and be the best at it. My father always implemented the importance of giving back to your community and especially in an environment where you were raised. Right before the 707 season start, I make it a point that I, I actually call parents and I actually reach out to kids who I feel have the gift to play this game at the next level. My name is Juwan Powell, and I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. When I got the call, it was amazing. Like, wow, I can't even believe I'm on Cal team. My name is Jaden Hazelwood, and I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. And you know, Cal won't answer the phone. Like, he, he just know you already with a lot of energy. And uh, we just hit it off from there. I'm George Pickens, and I play for Hoover High School. He was like, how you doing? He was like, I want you on my team. I was like, oh my God, this is really my chance right here. All right, let's lock and load, man. Execute, communicate, and let's execute, go, man. man. Have fun on three, one, two, three, have, have fun. fun. My all-star team has a big impact on the development of each and every kid that has ever came through. We've seen kids have zero offers, and then all of a sudden, they blossom to 12, 14, 15 different offers. Everybody knows what they're there for, just to get better. Positively or negatively, did it impact the change the game? One pick, one touchdown, one incomplete. It's up to me and the foundation staff to bring it out of them, and that's what we try to do. When I'm at practice, I make it a, a point that I'm not just there, I'm teaching. Know your job, know your responsibility, be where you're supposed to be, trust the process, be a smart, intuitive football player. They know that they have somebody in their life that's, number one, caring about who they really are as a person, and number two, that's holding them accountable. Communicate, that's all it is, communicate. Talk, communicate. I'm equally reciprocated by the energy that they give off to me. I'm totally grateful by the opportunity because I see so much of me in them. Give me he say whoa. Whoa. Give me he say whoa. whoa. Can it beat us? No. Can it beat us? No. You don't got to do nothing special to be what? Special. Special. Let's rock and roll, man. Hey. Let's rock and roll. Hey, hey fella, hey. One, two, three. That's the We come out here for one reason, one reason all, is to win the whole thing. Who gonna beat us? Nobody. When y'all start taking it personal, that's when we gonna take over.